Hello children. In today's video, we are going to see Class 12 Applied Maths Activity 2. These are the Excel activities. We all know in the subject of Applied Mathematics 241. For practical part, we will be, we are given Excel activities, spreadsheet activities. In the student support material, CBSE have recommended few activities. In those activities, I have selected few activities and giving those uh, activities, demo of those activities in this videos. This is the second video on that series. This video is about the graphs of function on Excel. Continue to the linear function. This is quadratic function. We have to maintain a record notebook for applied mathematics. So, the right side, whatever syntax, the procedure I have given, you can write only these things in the right side, not like a lab manual of uh, 041 maths. And children follow these steps and they will be working in the spreadsheet and take the output, take the printout of the output and stick it in the left side. So far the demo we have taken a quadratic equation of 3x square minus 5x minus 6. We all know quadratic equation means power 2 equation. So go to Excel, open a new spreadsheet. I have opened a new spreadsheet. So this is about quadratic function. Now we are going to apply values of x for this function. Now this function is 3x square minus 5x minus 6 function. I am giving some random values for x. Here I have given minus 7, minus 5, minus 3, minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3 and 5. So as I think these values are too nearer to get the exact parabola, I changed few of the values to a bigger extent. So now I have given you the x value, some random x value as we like we can take. Now this equation is x square minus 5, 5x minus 6. Now I am going to get the value. See here. To get the value, click on the y cell that is near to the minus 25. Click the cell. Put equal to same equation. We have to type here. Same like 3 x square. In place of x alone, we will be applying this minus 25, right? So, 3 x square. x square in place of x, just click the value of x cell equal to 3 into when you click the cell, instead of x, the cell which is presenting the x value will be displayed there. Square. So, power so, 3x square is over minus 5 into, again I cannot click the same cell, so I manually type the cell number B9. So, minus 5x is over minus 6. I have typed the formula. You can see in the place of x, only the blue letters are showing the x value which I am going to input in the cell. Put enter, you are getting the value. Now click the same cell, drag it till the last value. I am getting some values of this function. Now select the entire table, select the entire table, go to insert, go to insert. Here you can see bar graph, line graph, pie chart, and scatter plots. Click the scatter plots chart get inside you will be seeing two types of parabola this parabola is parabola is a graphical representation of quadratic equation it will be like a u so here this is without points this is with point so with the points it will be looking nice so i have added this graph now see here in this graph you can minimize as you wish Okay, here see the highest values are 
25 and minus 25 on either end. The other values are very close to one another. So I am not getting an exact parabola. So I wanted to change the value. See here I am changing the value. Minus 15. Or minus 20. Minus 10. Minus 5. Plus 5. Some 12 and 25. Okay. So like this, for whatever value for x, make an equation. You will get the value of y. Select both the values of x and y. Go to insert and whatever graph you want, you insert. That's all. The graph of a quadratic equation is inserted. So in the next video, I will be giving the exponential function, graph of exponential function. Thank you.